Hey, what's up? It's Philip, and welcome back to the channel. Uh, today's video is all about uh, landscape materials. I just found out that on the marketplace you, we have an awesome free uh, landscape auto material that you need to know about. If you didn't know about it, uh, I think this is a gold mine for uh, all of us. Uh, so uh, thank the creator for making this free for. Uh, everyone. I'll show you how to install it, use it and uh, how to uh, change some uh, textures and how to import your own height map and uh, apply those uh, materials uh, to your own height map. So uh, let's start. The first step is to download our auto material. So go to Epic Games uh, Marketplace and over here type in this MW Landscape Auto Material and click over here Add to Project. And you can uh, choose your projects over here, but I'm using testing 5.5 uh, Unreal Engine version. So I will click Show All Projects and click Auto Material 2. And I will select the closest version, which is 5.4 and click add to project and it will fairly quickly add your uh, auto material uh, to your project so when you go over here you can see on the left side we have this mw landscape auto material to check out uh, our uh, auto material we have uh, some maps already built so go to maps and we have the desert example island and mountain range let's click mountain range and if i go f11 you can preview the map, which looks super, super awesome. As you can see, we have some lakes over here, some water. We have uh, foliage and we have mountain range. What is good about this is if we go to a landscape mode and uh, try to change things, we can easily paint our landscape without any problems and it will adapt to our painting. And with this way, we can easily create our landscape. Okay, this is how the auto material looks like uh, for out from the box. But what if we want to add this material to our own landscape? Uh, to do that, we will go to new level and create basic. We don't need to save anything. We can delete this floor. We can go to landscape and we can create landscape over here. But I would like to import from file and I will import height map file. Height map is this, sorry, it's on my other monitor. If you go to motionforgepictures.com, you can see some landscape height maps. Over here, you can download this for free, use for games, for everything, because they are under the Creative Commons Zero Universal uh, license, so you can use as you want. And you can just download, for example, uh, Rocky Rivers, click here to download, go to Google and click from there Google Drive. We can import this Grand Mountain, so just double click it inside and find the height map PNG. Drag and drop it outside and now go back to Unreal Engine and you can click import from file, height map file and height map and you can see the height map over here. It's a pretty flat so I will just go with, I don't know, 400 and the material, this is the important part, we can go to MW landscape auto material and go to materials and since this is some mountains we can add go to landscape and add this mountain range example so just drag and drop it to material and click import and we have our landscape but where is it so press F to locate it and we have problems with exponential high folks so turn it off so you can find your landscape it's over here all the way down to fix this, select your landscape and under location, click over here to B0, 0 and 0. And now our landscape is uh, at the center. So we can enable back exponential high fog, select it. You can just go with the fog density of 0. Or here you can see we have our material. If I go a little bit inside like this, uh, we can go play from here and we can check our level. And of course, if you want to change something, I will go control L to move a sun a little bit here. So it looks a bit better. For example, if we want to change a uh, material over here, you can select this auto material that we uh, use for this uh, project and double click it. And uh, under the, for example, grass, you can change the texture over here. So to change the texture, we can go with the content browser with control and space. And over here, I can see that I don't have a starter content. So go over here, add feature or content pack. 
content, starter content. So we can have some nice textures uh, to uh, play with. Let's go to starter content, let's go to textures. So let's for example, you want to use this fire texture, it doesn't go, completely doesn't go with this. So select it, make sure it's selected, go to material and just click this arrow button over here. So use asset from content browser. And if you go over here into our level, you can see how we can easily change textures in our auto material so it can represent some lava or something uh, something like something like this and this is it uh, if you find this helpful let me know in the comments below drop some likes and if you want you can subscribe to the channel so you can get uh, more of uh, these uh, videos uh, every week uh, i think or every few days so uh, uh have a nice day and see you in some other video bye bye